Okay, this is the MacBook Pro 2008 15 inch. To give you an idea how it works. <coughs> So we have the, the hard drive separated between the uh, operating system and the programs on one side and then we have the data, all the videos. Here you can have the films like I like to use VLC and uh, I think I have a diagnosis. And <clears throat> iPhotos library, you can keep all your photos over here. All your music on this side that way your machine is always running fast it's too bright that window light is yes very bright there's word documents okay um so launch pad launch pad gives you all this garage band i photos App Store. This is the fan control app cleaner. Super duper. That's for doing uh, image backups, and that you should do as soon as you buy the thing. You should get a, a uh, you get an external drive, and you you save an image of the hard drive uh, to the super duper, and then uh, to the external drive, and then you just if you get into any trouble, you you can reboot. Oh, there's two really nice programs. This YouTube downloader. That's very nice. Uh, you go to YouTube, and you you can. Um, um, you just cut and paste your your videos there and whatever you find in YouTube you cut it and then you paste it here and then it downloads it and it's all set up to download onto the data drive uh, and there was another really nice handbrake if you uh, what I found out about handbrake is that all you need to do to to use that is you just I've loaded it with a special thing that breaks the security codes so that you can back up your videos or whatever, your DVDs, you can back up your DVDs with this thing. It's very nice. You don't need to buy those uh, expensive, um, you know, DVD rippers. This does a very nice job at doing that. And um, like I said, it's, it's, a, it's open source, so it's very nice, quick and easy. Um, okay, well, there's a lot of a lot of things this thing can do. This is really uh, the, the full. It has the full power that the new ones. It's only slightly. Okay, the virtual box. You can run the Windows Seven here. Very nicely. It's just it's the old uh, it saves the startup window so you don't have to go through the rebooting so what I have set it up is you can go right here this is the D drive the data drive on your on the computer here where all the Mac stuff is so all your documents all, all those things you can use right on Windows if you want so it's great great a great power in this so if you like Windows you can you can have both Mac and Windows at the same time so this machine does that quite well And you just save the state that it was in so you don't have to reboot the virtual drive all over again. Does it very quickly. Okay, uh, let's see, we have down here Microsoft Word.